Welcome to Today in Nerd History. The Star Trek The Next Generation episode, The High Ground, aired January 29th, 1990. In this episode, the crew get caught up in a civil war on Rutia 4 when Dr. Crusher is abducted by a radical terrorist group. The Star Trek Deep Space Nine episode, Crossfire, aired January 29th, 1996. In this episode, Odo must face his feelings for Kira when she falls in love with First Minister Shakar, her former resistance leader. The Star Trek Voyager episode, Threshold, aired January 29th, 1996. In this episode, a specially outfitted warp-capable shuttlecraft piloted by Tom Paris, successfully reaches Warp 10, breaking the trans-warp barrier. But the side effects of breaking the barrier may cost the crew of Voyager their best helmsman. The Star Trek Voyager episode Coda aired January 29th, 1997. In this episode, after her apparent death, Captain Janeway's journey to the afterlife, guided by her father, leaves her with suspicions. Happy birthday, Tom Selleck. Born January 29th, 1945. Thomas William Selleck is an American actor and film producer. He is best known for his starring role as the private investigator Thomas Magnum in the TV series Magnum P.I., which is based in Hawaii. Not a bad job if you can get it. <laughs> he also plays police chief Jesse Stone in a series of made-for-TV movies based on Robert B. Parker novels. Since 2010, he has also been a primary cast member as NYPD Commissioner Frank Reagan in Blue Bloods on CBS. He has appeared in more than 50 films and television roles since Magnum P.I., including Three Men and a Baby, Quigley Down Under, Mr. Baseball, and Lassiter. He appeared as Dr. Richard Burke on Friends and as A.J. Cooper on the TV series Las Vegas. Happy Birthday, Heather Graham. Born January 29, 1970. Heather Joan Graham is an American actress. After appearing in television commercials, her first starring role in a feature film came in 1988 with the teen comedy License to Drive, followed by her breakthrough role in 1989's Drugstore Cowboy. She then played supporting roles in movies such as Shout, Digstown, Six Degrees of Separation, Swingers, and in a TV series Twin Peaks and its prequel film Fire Walk With Me. Also movies in Lost in Space and Boogie Nights. In 1999 she co-starred in Bowfinger and Austin Powers The Spy Who Shagged Me. In the 2000s she starred in Committed, Say It Isn't So, Anger Management, Mary, Grey Matters, the Hangover, and The Hangover Part 3. She also had a role in the TV series Scrubs in 2004 before playing the title character in the one episode Emily's Reasons Why Not 
in 2006. She is a public advocate for Children International and supported the climate change campaign Global Cool in 2007. Happy birthday, Mark Singer. Born January 29th, 1948. Before the height of his career, he appeared in the sequel to the miniseries Roots as Colonel Warner's elder son, Andy. He has been in several fantasy adventure films and TV series, such as The Beastmaster and its sequels, in which he played the title role and as Mike Donovan in the 1983 TV miniseries V, the 1984 sequel V, The Final Battle, and the TV series V, The Series, which all are really, really good for their time. Other roles include the 1982 film If You Could See What I Hear, Body Chemistry, Something for Joey, Watchers 2, High Desert Kill, the Fighter, Go Tell the Spartans, Dead Space, and A Man Called Sarge. He voiced the character of Man Bat on Batman the Animated Series, and he has guest starred on TV series such as Dallas, The Twilight Zone, The Hitchhiker, Murder, She Wrote, The Young and the Restless, The Ray Bradbury Theater, and Highlander the Series, which is another really good series. He appeared in the last episode of Season 2 of the new version of V. However, instead of reprising his role of Mike Donovan, he plays a new character called Lars Trennant. He played a reoccurring role as General Matthew Shreve on Arrow's third season. Happy Birthday, Jessica Stone! Born January 29, 1990. Jessica D. Stone is the actress who played Nara in the Star Trek Enterprise first season episode, Detained. Her first credits include the miniseries Knots Landing, Back to the Cul-de-Sac, the movie Brave New World, and several episodes of Chicago Hope. She had a guest role in an episode of Seventh Heaven, and appeared in the movie Play Dead, Wheels Locked, A Light in the Forest, The Migration of Clouds, and voiced Marcy in the TV special A Charlie Brown Valentine. Aww. Her Star Trek performance was followed by a reoccurring role in Six Feet Under and the animated series Stanley and in a special to this series, Stanley's Dinosaur Roundup. Further credits include Room to Grow and guest roles in the series Hannah Montana and Ned's Declassified School Survival Guide. She also reprises her voice performance of Marcy in the TV special He's a Bully, Charlie Brown. She then played Stacy Taylor in the final ER episode and in the end. Remembering Mark Dempsey, born January 29, 1936, and passed away April 4, 1994. He was an actor who played the Air Force captain in the Star Trek episode, Tomorrow is Yesterday. Among his acting credits are the films Valley of the Dragons, Palm Springs Weekend, O Calcutta, The Prodigal, and To Cross the Rubicon. He also guest starred on TV series such as G.E. True, Hawaiian Eye, 77 Sunset Strip, Perry Mason, and Bergerac. Well, that's it for today, folks. I appreciate you listening, and uh, if you enjoyed the show, please feel free to tell your friends about uh, little old me here. Have a wonderful day.